to increase the lead. And he has nailed it. What a good kick that is. Hey guys, I'd like to take you through my kicking routine. This is something that's pretty important for me as a player and something that I've learned so much in the last couple of years. And um, if anything, it's more of a, an awareness um, skill, making sure that I'm as present as I can be in my goal kick and making sure that uh, my mind isn't going elsewhere. Something I do when I first goal kick is I look at the post and visualising first uh, the ball going over. And that's even before I put the tee down to set up the ball. When I do set up the tee on the ball, I kind of have it on a forward slant, making sure that I do have a, a good visual on the sweet spot of where I want to kick the ball. My awareness is, is really high at this stage. I'm staying as present as I can in the kick and not worrying about anything else. As I come back to my kicking position, I take four steps back and three to the side. And I start to sort of get on my tippy toes a wee bit and just sort of feeling uh, the pull on my calf. And I look at the post and I come back down to the ball. I do that twice and within those two times I'm visualising the ball going over. On the second time I'm coming down to the ball, I slightly lean forward, sort of feeling your hamstrings pull. And when I go back to take my kick, it's all about the ball and where I want to kick the ball and my mind is there and nowhere else. You know, as a replay, player, you can think about things outside of footy and, and the crowd and someone that's heckling you. Um, but I'm trying to do what I can do to control the ball going over, and for me, that's staying really um, in my process. No problem at all.